everybody, Valerie Jampolsky here and welcome to day four of the Super Women Fast Start Bootcamp. <laughs> so, you know your why, you're plugged in, you have your accountability and today I'm going to talk about avatars. Avatars, what the heck is an avatar? Avatar, and when you understand them, how you can sell to anyone. Now, this avatar, I know most, most of you immediately probably think about the movie. First of all, I just want to check this out. Look at this background. Gorgeous, gorgeous area here. I wanted this for you guys so you can have a hypnotic background and be able to focus on the video. <laughs> Alrighty, okay. So here's the deal. What is an avatar? Now, a lot of you might think, I'm here with my kids in the background, so if there's noises, any noise that you hear from them is going to ultimately get you to focus in deeper to what I'm saying here. So, what is an avatar? An avatar, a lot of you might think of the movie, okay? And no, it's not the movie. It's not, it's not the movie. What an avatar is, is it's, it's who are you actually, who's your ideal customer? Who are you really talking to? Because a lot of us, a lot of you think, oh, my, my product, my product, everybody wants it. And the thing is, is I, you probably heard of this. The riches are in the niches or niches, however you want to say it. I say the riches are in the niches. Well, I'll give you an example. I'm an organic vegan. Okay. If you have the most incredible steakhouse on the planet, I'm sorry, you can't sell it to me. You just, this is not going to happen. Okay. <laughs> vegan also means I don't, I, I, I don't eat dairy. I just don't. And I'm allergic to it on top of that. So I don't care how good your shake is. If it's got dairy in it, you're not gonna be able to sell it to me. I'm not your person. All right. So, so the thing is you really, you, and that's on a very superficial level, but you really need to know who it is, who is, who is your ideal person. If you were to think of the absolute perfect person for you in your business, all right? The absolute, who are the people that you want as, as your customers? Who, is, who are the people that you want to work with if you're building a team? Who do you want? Who are you, who are you wanting to reach? Okay? And what I want you guys to do is I want you to take out a piece of note paper, take out a pen and paper and take notes. And if you need to pause the video right now to go do that, go ahead. Okay, so now you got something to write with, all right? Here's the deal. I want you to write out some categories. You may want to keep pausing the video and write these things down. Okay. What, when, when, when they wake up in the morning, what's their first thought? As they're driving to work or wherever they're going, what are they thinking about? When they're, when they're coming home, what are they thinking about? What, is, what do they love? What do they, what are their problems? What do they like? What are your avatar specific problems? What does she think about, worry about throughout the day? What does she dream about, wish for? What does she like? What does she value? What's her name? Does she have kids? How many? What are their ages? What are her kids' names? Do they have any pets? What are the pets' names? What work does she do? How old is she? Now, for some folks, maybe the easiest thing is to look at somebody, to look at yourself and say, you know what, I'm really my, I am really, I'm the, I am it, I'm the avatar. Think, write it out for you. Write it out for you because the key is in your marketing, when you can talk to that person, when you can talk to that person, talk, you'll be able to talk to their specific problems and, 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 and the solutions that they really want, that's when the magic happens. Because that's when you're really meeting people's needs. And the key with this is your why. Because if you've get, if you've figured out your why, what is it that, that really matters to you? Right? So for me in my marketing, for me, like for example, you know, one of the things I focus on is people that have kids, right? And people that want to be at home with their kids. They don't want the kids to be put in daycare. That's just a piece of a piece, it's not all of it, but it's a piece of my avatar of somebody that has that concern. Okay. And you know, are you talking to people? Are they married? Are they single? Are they, are they baby boomers? What are they? Who, are, who, who specifically give them a name? How many kids do they have? Do they have kids? What do they do? What's their world? What do they, what, what is their day? And then you can talk to that person when you're, when you, when you're communicating in whatever marketing it is, whether it's a blog or, or a video or any form of marketing, any copy, anything at all, you know, trainings, whatever it is, you are focusing on that person. That's the key. You're talking to that person. And when you do that, seriously, magic happens. So I want you to write out a whole day. Like what would be the day? What would be the day of, of the person? What do they think of? What goes through their minds? What are their problems? What do they want? Let me give you another quick thing. 
And that is when somebody is wanting to buy a drill, they're not looking for the features of the drill. They want to make a hole. Okay, I'm sure you might have heard that before. What is it that they really want? It's kind of like, what is your really why? Focus in on that for that person and you will have magic. So stay tuned for tomorrow where we're going to be talking about why your story has value and we're going to be putting a lot of this all together. So remember that. Who are you talking to? Mwah! Love you all. And here's your assignment. Do this for two or three different avatars. One day in the life of the avatar based on the details of who they are, their age, their occupation, their kids, their names, their pets, their fears, their worries, their loves, the books they read, the fun activities, their dreams, their values, etc. What are their problems? What are their dreams? And remember, as you do this assignment, know you have all the wisdom inside of you. Trust your life for the answers within.